Elmer Collins 1966 hair and it's Christmas Eve 2021 and I am about to make dessert for tomorrow pecan pie pecan 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 whatever you want to call it so we're going to start by putting three eggs in the bowl. Now this is a very simple recipe. I watched it um, on Facebook actually. We're gonna beat up these eggs here. Anytime I can find an easy recipe, I'm gonna go for it. So to those three eggs, we are going to add a half a cup of sugar. And we're going to mix it. Let's turn on our oven at 350. Simple enough. Now we are going to use a white corn syrup and a little tip. We need a cup of it. So to prevent that sticky corn syrup from sticking to the measuring cup, lightly spray the inside of the cup and supposedly the corn syrup will not stick. So I'm just gonna squeeze a cup of corn syrup into the cup. There we have it. And I sprayed it with the pan. And let's see if this runs out really easy. Not bad at all. We will make sure we get it all. And we're going to give that a stir. And you're beginning to feel the thickening of it. Mm. We're also going to add in a teaspoon of vanilla. Alrighty. And we have two cups of coarsely chopped pecans. Pecans, and uh, we're just going to give this a good little mix here. So here we have it. How simple is that? So it looks good. I actually probably could throw in. I'm just using the compliments pieces. Um, I need some more. Yeah, sure. And we're going to bake this at 350 until it's set, but still a little jiggly in the center. And some people add butter to their filling, and uh, some people don't. So I'm not going to bother to add any butter. I'm just going to do this as per the recipe that I'm using. Alrighty, so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna be lazy today. Normally I'd make my own pie crust, but we're just gonna use a store-bought deep dish uh, pie crust and we're not gonna poke holes in it. And we're just gonna pour this mixture 
onion. Doesn't get much easier than that until you make a mess. Right. <laughs> but it should be good. So we're going to uh, wait for our oven to preheat and then we're going to be putting this in the oven and I will show you what it looks like when it's done. So stay tuned. Well, so folks, here we have it. Our dessert for tomorrow. Thanks for watching.